Hey, what's up guys, Destructor here. Welcome back to another episode of Factions. Now, today, I'm just going to show the base, and then we're going to go into a raid. This raid took me a long time to edit, so I hope you guys enjoy. We'll do that. But first, the winner was Mike the Killer. I did give him his stuff already, but you can actually grind tokens by killing, um, by killing mobs, and then you can actually just buy the rank right here, which is 5,000. So you got to kill 5,000 mobs, and to check how much money you have, you do such token battle. I recently cashed out, so I only have two tokens. Um, but now, and you can actually win keys as well. But these ruby keys literally are the best, so. Oh, we just went, four bid rock. These are the best two ruby keys. I've opened probably six, six or seven ruby keys this map. And so if I've got nothing but just gen buckets and emeralds, but now we've got four bedrock and two IGs. Okay, so this is the first place. This is the collection room for the creepers and the IGs. So obviously, as you can, can see, it does get quite full quite easily. We actually emptied this out just, I don't know how long ago. But this is a IG one as well. We actually uh, emptied this out quite recently. And that's basically some storage. If we come in here, uh, we have more storage here, and this is our villager, an enderman drop. This gets full easily as well. We actually are our third in F-top right now. I don't know if we, we... We usually hover around third, and as you can see, that's how many spawners we've got. Um, so we actually, um, on the server, it costs money to mine your spawners. So I we kind of protected them, so it's hard to see them, but I can show you. These ones aren't protected, but this is how many of those we have. Uh, we have around 50, I think. You can actually mine spawners by mine I think it's 7,000 blocks or 5,000 blocks or whatever so this is our villager and enderman grinder this is villager 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 that's enderman and enderman so it's quite a bit but yeah and this is our IG this is all IG pretty good I think we have around 35 40 I don't know and this is all creeper we have a lot of creeper spawners yeah we get a lot of TNT so hopefully we should raid again soon but um, yeah, we should be able to raid soon. So let me actually show you the top of our base. I think Yas is working on it right now. I'm not 100% sure. Uh, yeah, there we go. So this is the top of our base. Uh, don't really know what that means. I think it means cooking in some language. I think Dutch, I'm not 100% sure. Uh, that's a frying pan, as you can see. Uh, and then this goes to one side. So let's go to this side. So, before we actually get into this raid, if you guys could leave a like and a comment, I actually do respond to all my comments. So, yeah, please leave a like and a comment. Because uh, this did take me a long time to edit the raid. So, if you're wondering what this is, this is like a check area, I'll show you in a second. This is some sand and obby walls. This is on like every side, if you're wondering. I think they're making some more walls on this side. Pretty cool stuff. And it's really easy to make walls on the server. If you guys want to join the server, I'll put the IP on the screen now. Uh, so of course I should off warp check. So this is the checkbox. So basically, if when you're raiding the base and obviously these sand pillars get destroyed, the redstone gets destroyed. And if the redstone gets destroyed, then well, don't know if I'm actually yeah, it'll be fine. Then it does this. And usually when we're not on and we have an alt in here, we can pretty much hear the noise. So we'll know we're getting graded and it's like near the outside of our wall. So, you know, it's pretty good and it goes all along our base, which is really cool. Uh, so, yeah, we can pretty much know if we're getting graded or not, which is quite handy to be honest.
I got five. <laughs>